Hi, I'm Shane from MN Arsenal, and we have Jeremy Moskowitz, Microsoft MVP for Group Policy. That's right. So what are we going to do today? Today, we're going to describe how you can, well, actually, you tell me. You ever have anybody ask you, how do you open up the right browser for the right website? Well, I've got people say, I've got applications that work in this and that. Exactly right, mm -hmm. because they get a crappy experience if they're using the wrong browser. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to demonstrate how, well, you're going to show how to just get Chrome out there for maybe people who don't have Chrome or okay. Firefox or whatever. And then after that, we're going to say, when you open up, when you're in the wrong browser, open up the right browser for the right website. That's called the Policy Pack browser router, and then we're going to check that out. Okay, sweet. So um, we're going to go to Computer 2? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to push out Chrome to Computer 2. I think we've already got Firefox and Internet Explorer out there. Which is reasonably standard. So some apps might be ActiveX and require IE. Yep. And, uh, and then others might say, no, you have a better experience in Google. Or, or you, know, you want all of your local intranet sites to be used, say, in Internet Explorer. Okay. Well, let's just put this out to Computer 2. Okay. And uh, yeah, there it goes. So it's now being getting pushed out there. So let's right. take about a minute. Great. So while that's cooking with gas, what I'm going to do is go over to my Group Policy Management Console. For all of my Deadwood users, uh, actually, no, my standard users, mm -hmm. I want to um, manage the right website with the right browser. How about that? That's a great GPO name. I like very descriptive GPO yes, names. You too. <laughs> Not that I would use that in production, but that's a general gist. Okay, so under user side, policy pack, um, this is a node we haven't explored yet in any of our videos. So we're gonna click on the browser router node. Browser so router. yeah, browser router. We thought that was an interesting name. So have you ever had a, a scenario where different browsers say, I wanna be in charge. No, I wanna be the default. I wanna be the, yeah. okay. So all we're gonna do to make that problem go away is add new default browser and uh, which, what's your favorite one? Oh, Chrome. Chrome. And then when we click on Chrome, and that that's the end of that problem. All right. The end. But then if I have an ActiveX application that only wants to work in yeah. IE. So we'll create a new policy. So for instance, let's say you wanted to say whenever you go to Microsoft.com, that's just the name of the policy, so I'll copy it. We'll say whenever you go to that URL, go to Internet Explorer, and that's it. Oh wow! And That's I, saw, it. I saw regex there, so you guys can use regular expressions. Yep. Yeah, if you are, if you know how to do that, you could do that, or you could say anytime you go to anything in Google Land, you can say go to a wildcard, and anything star Google star that'll go to Chrome. Awesome. All right, and then we can also say add a new policy for um, star Firefox star, and we'll make that go to wildcard of Firefox, and then let's say somebody wants to be naughty. Okay. So we can say add a new policy, and if they go to, um, let's not be super naughty, let's go to XYZ, <laughs> okay? So if they go to a wild card That's of my favorite star site. XYZ, we're going to block it and say, no, no, don't do that. Okay, does that make sense? So we're, we're gonna have a pop-up. So that's it, that's browser router. You simply decide what things you wanna do for what websites. Of course, you can even say, if you know, anything that's in a, Defined as a local intranet, mm -hmm. go to Internet Explorer. Oh, that's great because you, you'll have a lot of app, a lot of companies that say we have we have uh, applications you know that you have to access your time card or whatever that have has to, be... to use the right exactly you got on the right track. And for Internet Explorer, we can also set the what's called the default browser mode, so we mm -hmm. can make IE eleven render in specific modes if that's what you require. So we're not going to demonstrate that, but you get the general gist. That's great. That's it. So we've defined our routes. We'll go over to our endpoint there, which is computer two. Do oh look at that. Chrome magically delicious. We'll run <laughs> GP update just to get the latest greatest signal that we just got that we just created in group policy land. We'll wait for this to finish. I would have called that that, po that no no policy, bad touch. Bad, bad touch. Bad touch. Bad touch, good touch. All right, and that should be it. Now there's a couple ways we can demonstrate this. If we go to say write, our good old write guy, what do we say? We said if we went to www.microsoft.com, www.google.com, www.firefox.com, and www.xyz.com, right? Mm. Those are the scenarios. So let's see if, if it all works. Okay. So we'll click on Microsoft. That was supposed to be? Well, obviously, Firefox. No, Internet Explorer, <laughs> right? And that's exactly what it did. That's and fantastic. If we go to Google, what do we say? Chrome, baby. Let's see if that is what happens. And we just installed Chrome, so maybe, you know, I wasn't, I was, I wasn't sure if it needed to have been opened once. There we go. Nope, so we, Chrome, we Chrome did its thing. Uh, what was Firefox? Firefox, right? That's a pretty easy one. So let's see if that actually does what it's supposed to do. There you go. But this gets better even faster. Hold on, check this out. We'll go to xyz.com and, no, no. 
don't do that. Oh, okay. But wait a second. Here's where we can really turn the juice on. Let's say you're here that's, in, that's, in Internet that's Explorer. That's juice enough right there. Huh? In a tab, in a new tab, and you say, you know what? I really want to go to Google.com. This is the wrong browser. Mm -hmm. Watch this. Fantastic. From one browser, we're going to route you to the right browser. So if you only have one tab open, we're going to close that tab and open up the right browser. All right. What if they don't have the right uh, browser installed? Then we will default back all the way through if they don't to Internet Explorer. Okay. Good. And that is Browser Router, opening up the right I browser like for the right website. Talk about, talk about getting a handle on your environment, on all your computers. You can, this, is, this works with almost any, I, any need that people have. This is fantastic. Yeah, you can deploy, your, deploy your and upgrade your browsers using PDQ, manage the heck out of those browsers using Policy Pack. That's the deal. Jeremy Moskowitz, the MVP babies. Thanks, I'm Shane. Guys. We'll talk to you guys later, right? Thank you very much.